My name is Adrian and I really quickly wanted to go over what it took for me to pass the CompTIA Cloud Plus exam in a little bit over a month. Was it easy? Not really. Was it comprehensive? Yes, it was. Did it take up all of the time? I had about 10 minutes left. The first item for study I utilized was the Cybex CompTIA Cloud Plus book, the study guide. Looks like here you could buy used for $33.99, buy used $41.05. If you go on eBay, you can actually find these sometimes for, for close to nothing. You'll sometimes find people selling them to you. If you buy two or three, you get one free. And each book is like five to ten dollars. They go fast, but if you continually look, I'm sure you can find something. The second was the IT Pro TV CompTIA Cloud Plus CV0002 video series. It's a total of 22 hours and five minutes. You can change the speed of it to go a little bit faster or slower to fit your schedule and your pace. Both were relatively good materials. The videos reinforced the reading, which I felt was the biggest benefit come test time. So the Cybex book is this one here, CompTIA Cloud Plus Study Guide, second edition by Montgomery Olson. It's a total of 10 chapters, and it also has a pre-test assessment. With this book, the way that I went through the material was I would read the chapter, take the end of the chapter assessment, jot down any items that I got wrong or any terms I was not familiar with. At the conclusion of the 10th chapter test, I went ahead and did the pre-test assessment to give myself a practice examination. The items that I got incorrect or were not familiar with from the practice, I added to that same sheet for the end of the chapter review and went over those items all together. Now, there were periods of time where I was watching the videos of IT Pro TV at the same time, so they did reinforce some of the things that I had questions on. But ultimately, going back the second time, through the index of the book, finding the items that I needed more information on, but probably the most beneficial. Biggest tip I can give you is to actually read. The Cloud Plus material isn't really anything that's going to be covered in any of the other CompTIA exams. It is, like it sounds, it's specific to the cloud. It does touch upon some security, basic security principles. It does touch upon some basic networking principles, such as you know, virtual networks and segmentation, um, things of that nature. The best approach is to allocate time to study and to set a date for yourself as to when you want to complete the test. When I first started studying, I said I wanted to complete the test within a month. So I'd split those chapters up so that I would be able to achieve that goal within the month. Another good thing to do is to keep a log. You keep a log of what you did. You can keep a track of your progress and where you're slipping up. You know when you need to catch up and when you need to prioritize entertainment versus your education. The way that I kept a very good log was with blog posts. So this way I was able to track my own movement through the book and make sure I wasn't skipping anything over. It's also a good way to keep in contact with your followers and those looking to do the same. Oh yeah, the IT Pro TV videos, J just watch them. Um, I watch them at one and a half speed to go through them a little bit quicker to each their own. And good luck, you can do it too. All your hard work is gonna pay off. You're gonna get that certification. You're gonna get those stackables and you're gonna realize that a few hours in the past is going to mean a lifetime of change. You're still here? Go read the book already. The video's done.